All right, so it's getting complicated here because she thinks her husband is cheating on her with their ex-girlfriend. Their ex-girlfriend. Yes, they share an ex. Hey, Bert Show. I feel so weird sending you guys this email. Never thought I would be one of those people who need to reach out to a radio show to do my dirty work, LOL, but I don't know what else to do. You're not the first and you're the last. <laughs> Low backstory, my husband and I have been together for three years and have been in and out of the polyamory lifestyle almost the whole time. Last year, we had a girlfriend for about four months. The relationship was mostly great, but eventually our girlfriend decided that this lifestyle wasn't for her. Here we are almost a year later after that breakup with her. In the last year, my husband and I have done nothing but get closer to each other. It's been amazing up until the last month or so. He started to pull away from me, working long hours when I know he doesn't need to, constantly on his phone. I even noticed him getting up in the middle of the night to take phone calls. I did what any sane person would do. I snooped through his phone. (laughs) I looked through his text, nothing. Phone calls, nothing. Emails, still nothing. I thought I was in the clear until I got to my last resort, his contacts. He and I know most of the same people, and even if we don't, I know of them. While looking through the contacts, I noticed two contacts with the same name. One guess as to who it was. Our ex-girlfriend. Dun, dun, dun. (laughs) That's where I'm at. At this point, I don't know what to do. Should I confront him? Should I ask her? Should I try to catch him in the act? Please help. Thanks, All right, I'm a, listener. I'm a little bit um, confused as what the incriminating no, he, evidence here. Here's is. the incriminating evidence. There's a contact that she knows of, right? That let, let's say it's Stephen. Okay, she looked in the phone. There's two Stevens with two different phone numbers. She found that. So that means he took the ex girlfriend and has her number, but changed it to Stephen. That way, any interaction he has with Stephen. Like, he's got the two Stevens. He knows how to differentiate the two, but to her, it just looks like one Steven. So oh, she he changed to, the name? He changed the mm-hmm. girlfriend's name to Steven. Oh, I didn't catch that part. But they okay, got two different, like, but there's two different numbers in there, so he's communicating. She All she sees when she looks through text messages, he's just, he's just texting with Steve. There's two Steves. How the hell did she figure that out? That Damn. is amazing. Because she changed the girlfriend's name, he changed the girlfriend's name to Steve. Women play chess. Man. Dudes play checkers, that is man. Impressive. I may have done that before. <laughs> <laughs> so you have to go through all of the contacts or you're just looking no. at the numbers that they text? No, you just, you can tell, like, if you, you can see a discrepancy and if, like, the, like there's two different text mess chains, but it's the same name and you go and you look at the number, oh. you got to be a little bit more of a sleuth. I mean, it's an easy cover, but... But if you deep dive, you can you, you, you kind of have to know like everyone in somebody's life, though. Uh huh. Wow. Okay. Yeah. That's a lot. So <laughs> you that, don't know two Steves. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Think I'm an idiot. So this is a hers and hers and his situation. She backs out of it, and now he might be talking to the ex girlfriend again. What's the famous Chris Rock line that I always say? Oh, uh, <laughs> um, Tommy remembers it. What, I don't. Oh, you don't. Forget. Bah. Women can't. Women can't go back financially. Men can't, or whatever it yep. is. Women can't go back financially. Men can't go back sexually. There you go. So if you introduce a, another woman into it, that's it. You got to keep. That's it. where the bar's been set. Yes. That's where the bar's been set. I think it might be right here. That man is probably more times than not going to find his way back to that woman at some point. So what do you do in a case like this? What's the advice that you give her? You can't. You can't shut it down. Well, yeah, you can. <laughs> sure you can. Yeah, I mean, well, delete she did the Steve's. already. Delete both Steves. He'll, he'll find and now you Steve's. will never know another Steve. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they're married, and they agreed to do this polyamorous lifestyle. They had the girlfriend. The girlfriend broke up. I mean, this is cheating. If he's seeing the oh, girlfriend yeah. behind her back, this is 100% yeah. cheating. So she needs to confront him. The, hey, here's why guys are so stupid. You're so stupid. So here's a woman willing to like do a hers and hers and his relationship. She's already proven she's into it. She didn't get out of it because she didn't want to. It was the girlfriend that broke up. So rather than him go back to his wife and say, you know what? I really kind of enjoyed that with all three of us. Clearly she's open to it. He goes back to the ex. The only, what? That that makes no sense at all. But I think this is like, um, for some women, this would be like your worst nightmare who are delving into the polyamorous lifestyle. Like, you're worried that you bring another person into the relationship that your partner's going to fall more in love with them than you. And if he is continuing to have a relationship with the girlfriend, 
That's the pos- that that's like the worst case scenario. Okay. And- I'm assuming that if she probably got to the point where she didn't want to do a package thing anymore, but she still wanted to have him, and then he probably just couldn't fight that temptation and thought he could hide it. Dumbass. Yep. But the point much. of like being polyamorous is trusting each other like completely, and if he's like. Mm-hmm. Enjoy enjoying the excitement of sneaking around <laughs> that completely defeats the purpose. Yes. Yeah, you sure. have a woman that's willing. Like, yes, we can find another woman, no problem. He's like, nah, I'm gonna cheat on you instead. Yeah. You idiot. <laughs> <laughs> the bird show.